That baby gripping on to her tummy. Look at that. <coughs> Looks a bit awkward carrying a, a baby on your belly while running on all fours. Oh, there's another one. Another baby as well. Let me just go forward a little bit. But they seem to be uh, maneuvering. I think they're moving from marula tree to marula tree at the moment, uh, taking advantage of the wonderful Valentine's marulas. Here we go. Vervet monkey. You can see the little baby's tail coming up over hers. And disappearing. There's some sitting on that sort of bendy marula. And so. There we go, a little bit to the left. There we go. And she also, oh, lots of babies in this group. Oh, you can see the heat haze already starting to, to, to come through on camera. So normally, you only really get that heat haze if we're looking straight over the bonnet and the heat of the bonnet starts creating that heat haze. But I mean, already that heat haze today is going to be a scorcher. There we go, two moms. And two moms sitting in the marula tree with their babies. Isn't that sweet? Oh, hello, little one. Escape from mom, time to play. Stay with mom. I felt a little bit scared when the other one came jumping past me. Now, of course, Tingana was last seen in this area, so at least we know during the day if we hear the monkeys start alarming, uh, Tingana is probably somewhere in the, the Mwati River below the dam wall. You know, a bit of aloe grooming going on. Removing any ticks or fleas. Oh, off goes the baby. Well, one of them at least, I think. Oh, brave little guy going up, up and away. All the grooming going on. Shame. One's got no one to help him groom. He's got to groom himself. Eat his own parasites. I love it when they're chasing fleas because you can see that they're sort of moving their, their, their little hands very quickly to grab onto those fleas and then immediately pop in the mouth. Lovely serene shot. Yeah, 